Hello, this is Mr. Ahmed and today we'll do lesson 2.2 comparison problems. And our essential question is how does a module help you solve a comparison problem? Okay, so let's unlock the problem. Evans dog weighs seven times as much as Oxana's dog. Together the dogs weigh 72 pounds. Okay, so together both dogs are 72 pounds. How much does Evans dog weigh? Okay, so he told us that Evans dog weighs seven times as much as Oxana's dog. So if we know how much weight is Oxana's dog, we will multiply it by seven to know Evans dog weight, but we don't know Oxana's dog weight. We know that what both dogs weigh together. Okay, so this is a little complex problem. Let's see if the module will help us. So we will use the multiplication model here. Draw a model, let n represent the unknown. Okay, so we always make the unknown, which is n represent the smaller amount. So here we have two dogs, Evans dog way and Oxana's dog way. Evans is bigger, Oxana's is smaller. Okay, so Oxana's we will do it with n. Okay, and Evans we will do it seven n's. Okay, it's seven times as Oxana's, so we'll do it seven n's. So n n n n n n and seven ends okay he said here in the question together the dogs weigh 72 so together the seven ends and the one end they are 72 pounds so evens dog is seven ends and oxana's dog is one end so together they weigh 72 pounds so here Using the model, we will write the equation to find the value of n. So the value of n will be Oxana's dog weight. So here, what times n equals what? So we know that seven n's and the one n together they are eight n's. These are the weight of the two dogs together. So it's eight n's or eight parts equal 72 so it's 8 times n equals 72 7 n's for Evans dog and 1 n for Oxana's dog so 8 times n equals 72 what is the value of n we said that the n is like the space or the missing number so 8 times what equals 72 8 times 9 equals 72 so the value of n is 9 we said that n is oxana's dog weight so n is how much oxana's dog weighs we need to find evens dog weight so in step number three we need to find evens dog weight so one n is 9 so evens dog is 7 ends so multiply 7 by 9 7 times 9 will give us evens dog weight so 7 times 9 is 63 so evens dog weighs 63 pounds okay so let's see what we did again in the problem, we have two dogs, Evans dog and Oxana's dog. Evans dog is bigger. It's a seven times as much as Oxana's dog. And we know the weight of the two dogs together. They are 72. So the model will start by saying that the n, the unknown, will be for Oxana's, for the smaller one. So n is for Oxana's, 
So evens is seven times, so it will be seven ends. Together, they are 72. So seven ends and one end together, they are 72. So eight ends equals 72. So eight times n equals 72. So eight times what is 72? It's eight times nine. So the value of n is nine. Now we can find the weight of both dogs. N is Oxana's dog weight. So Oxana's dog weigh nine pounds. Okay, if we want Evans dog weight, we have to multiply seven by nine because it's seven n's. N is nine. So I'll multiply seven by nine, which is 63. That will give us Evans dog weight. Okay, get the next page. To find how many times as much use a multiplication model. To find how many more or fewer model the addition or subtraction. Okay, so if he said how many times as much, we will use the multiplication model. If he said how many more or how many fewer, we will use the addition or subtraction. Evens dog weighs 63 pounds. Oxana's dog weighs 9 pounds. How much does Evens dog weigh than Oxana's dog? How much more does Evens dog weigh than Oxana's dog? So how much more or how much less we will use addition or subtraction. Okay, so here is another model. So we will use an addition or subtraction model. First, let's draw the model. Okay, so the big one will be Evans dog. And the small part will be Oxana's dog. Okay, so we know that Oxana's dog is nine pounds and we solve it, the problem up. We said that Evans dog is 63 pounds. Okay, so how much more Evans dog? Evans dog is more than or weighs more than Oxana's dog by this amount. Yes, until here. Okay. So until here, these are the nine of Oxana's dog. What is shaded here is the rest of the 63. Okay, so we will call it N. Okay, so the N should be the 63 minus the 9. We will know this part. Okay, so here it will be 63 minus 9 equals N. So let's subtract 63 minus 9 to know the value of n. So 3 minus 9, it can't be. So the 6 will be 5 and the 3 will be 13. 13 minus 9 is 4. 5 minus nothing is 5. So the value of n is 54. So n is how much more evens dog weighs okay so evens dog weighs 54 pounds more than oxana's dog now for share and show maria's dog weighs six times as much as her rabbit together the pets weigh 56 pounds what does maria's dog weigh okay so maria's dog weighs six times as much as her rabbit it means that her rabbit is small so here is the rabbit 
and here is the dog so the dog is six times as much as the rabbit together they are 56 so together they are 56 pounds so let's say that the rabbit weigh n so n is the unknown so we always represent the smaller part by n so the dog will be six n's n n n n n n so together they are six plus one is seven n so seven times n equals 56 so seven times what equals 56 we know that seven times eight so the value of n is eight pounds so instead of n it's eight so seven times eight is 56 so the n is eight so the n is eight it means here is eight here is eight 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 so if we want the rabbit's weight it's eight pounds if we want the dog's weight it will be eight times six eight repeated six times so eight times six is 48 so maria's dog weighs 48 pounds okay hope you guys got the idea of this lesson you model then write the equation find the value of n it will be the smaller part and if you want the bigger part you will have to multiply okay here draw a model write an equation and solve last month kim trained three times as many dogs as cats if the total number of cats and dogs she trained last month is 28 how many cats did came train so let's draw the model we'll have a smaller part which is he said three times as many dogs as cats so cats is a smaller part dogs will be the bigger one so three times so we'll draw three times as cats so if we said that the cats is n so the dogs will be three n's okay so he said together they are 28 so together they are 28 okay so how many n's is 28 we have one two three four so four times n equals 28 this is our equation now we ask ourselves what times 4 equals 28 it's 4 times 7 okay so n equals 7 n is the number of cats so came trained seven cats okay so again we draw the model first the cats are less than dogs so we'll draw only one square this is for cats and three squares for the dogs okay we say that n is the number of cats so three n's will be the number of dogs together they are 28 so one two three four n's four times n is 28 so the n equal seven so came trained seven cats okay so here how many more dogs than cats did came train okay so first we need to know the number of dogs so the number of dogs we have three n's n is 7 so 3 times 7 it's 21 okay so we have 21 dogs let's draw the model here so these are 21 dogs and cats are only 7 only 7 like this so how many more dogs it will be this part it's like the 21 
we subtract this part from it we subtract 7 so 21 minus 7 will give us how many dogs more than cats so we can say that the missing part which is here this is n okay so n equals the 21 minus the 7 so n equals 21 minus 7 is 14 so Kim trained 14 dogs more than cats okay hope you guys enjoyed this lesson have a nice day and goodbye